For the second year in a row, the Greensboro Aquatic Center is hosting the Plunge for Elodie, a great way to get wet for a wonderful cause. Brenda Keyes is grandmother turned activist. Uh, <laughs> tell us what is the Plunge for Elodie? Um, the Plunge for Elodie is actually held um, to raise awareness and to raise funds for research for a rare disease called epidermolysis bullosa. Epidermolysis bullosa, or EB, is uh, one of those rare genetic skin disorders. Basically, um, the premise is the anchoring fibrils or the glue that holds your skin together is missing in children that are born with this disease. So their skin is very, very fragile um, and it's prone to blistering, shearing off, um, just tearing as a result of just very mild friction or trauma. And we know little children have lots of falls when they're lots learning to walk, when they're learning to run as they're climbing, and so it's really dangerous for children. It's uh, especially challenging for babies. Our grandson, who we're doing this in honor of, is three. We are hopeful that he has kind of passed that terribly rough stage where crawling, walking, falling, tripping, all that kind of stuff um, has led to some pretty nice injuries. But So, of course, he was born with it, and then you wanted to learn as much as you could about it. Right. And you heard about this plunge. What exactly was the connection to the plunge and this disorder? The plunge reality was started six years ago um, in the in honor of a little girl named Elodie Kubik. Um, she is six years old now, and when she was born, you know, her family, nobody in the hospital had any idea what this was. And so some friends of her mother's, some friends from high school actually, um, got together and said, you know, what can we do to support you? What can we do other than bringing you a casserole for dinner? So they organized a plunge in Wellesley, Massachusetts, where the water is cold, um, and this polar plunge like I said this is the sixth year they've been doing this polar plunge and this amazing group of women have raised um, almost five hundred thousand dollars to go to a research partnership that was actually co-founded by Eddie Vedder of Pearl Jam kind of interesting uh, because his wife's best friend from high school has a child with this disease also so all the money raised goes strictly 100% to research to find um, an effective treatment and hopefully a cure for this disease and we just contacted them after Brooks was born to see what can we do here to help with this cause and our plunge in honor of Brooks here at the Greensboro Aquatic Center just evolved and it was great last year so we hope to have a second successful plunge this year. Yeah, we saw people lined up around the edges of the pool. Uh, I, I know that at least one person jumped in with their clothes on. Yeah, <laughs> yes. We want to thank Ashton Clemens for that. She gave some opening remarks and jumped in fully clothed. It was great. It's, it's a lot of fun, and we get to do it inside where it's nice and nice warm. And warm. We have 88 degree water rather than having to cut the ice to jump in, which they've had to do several times in Massachusetts. Yeah, this is oh, more my here. speed. Yeah, yes. yes. I think so. Yeah, and so um, it's you just take donations? Is it come one come all? It is. Everybody's welcome. There's no fee. Of course, we will accept donations, but you don't have to make a reservation. Just show up. It is on March 25th from 12 to 2. We'll have some donuts, things to eat, but basically it's just a fun pool party. We have a great time. I mean, and we all need a reason to have a little, get in some warm, a, <laughs> some warm right. water this time of year, for right. sure. We just look at it as a fun fundraiser. <laughs> so. And when you think about your grandson, what is your greatest hope for him? Oh, it's such a tough disease and there are so many variables with it. You know, I just want him to be able to grow up and not have to worry about a consequence for every action he does. And, and you know, there's that potential there. And I just hate for any child to have to think, should I run across that parking lot or not? It, you know, if I fell, I could really hurt myself. And that's, that's not a childhood. So I want him to have the best childhood possible. We're going to try to make a big splash for him. Coming up on March 25th, Brenda, thank you so much. March 25th, right here at the Greensboro Aquatic Center, 12 until 2. You can find more about EB. You can find out more about the plunge. Just go to plungeforelody.org.